Hey guys, what's up? It's me here again, and today I have a dumbass trying to grab my cat. Trying to play with my pussy, it's not okay. But, this is a video all about, will you press the button? It's kind of like, would you rather, but it's just a different format for it. So, I think my cat's freaking out because it's getting molested, but I'm not sure. But, I hope you all are ready to see an awesome video, because eh, it might be awesome, but yeah. And I will... I'm not allowed to have cats because it, I let it lick peanut butter off my ball sack. Well, I'll see you all there. Okay, the first one up. You become the best musical composer on the planet, but you lose your sense of sight. That's a hard one because me personally, I really, really, really like music. But... I really like to see stuff too, so no, I think I'll pass on that. You did not press the button, 32% 32 32 of people pressed the button, yes, I'm with the uh, majority, 68% did not. Uh, well, I think that, that's a pretty good question. If you love music, I could see you saying that. You will be immortal, but everyone will hate you. Uh, that goes on whether or not you should go on with life or not and and in my eyes you shouldn't I mean, it's your time. It's your time. So no and I like it when people like me 64% did not press the button. You are good people good people die when you need to don't try don't try to push that shit back It's meant to be it's meant to be you have beers free forever. Oh, okay. You're free beer forever. That's <laughs> That's a pretty good one, but you're not able to get drunk ne never more and can't give the beers to anyone. Well, that's fucking pointless. No, why, why would I want unlimited beer, but I can't- what? 37% of people have pressed this button. Okay, I'm guessing you guys did not actually look at it. One, it's poorly spelled, well, poorly bad grammar, and two, why? You can't get drunk and you can't share the beer with anybody. So why would you want to do that? That's a bad question. That's a no, no. No. Bad. You can live in any fictional world of your choice. I just want to say yes on that no matter what. I don't care. You will have to be reborn as a member of the dominant species of the, in that world. Uh, hell yeah. I don't care if I have to be like a human. If I get to live in the Dungeons and Dragons realm, then uh, you know what? Fuck yeah, I don't care. That's perfect. 22% did not press the button. You guys, you don't, you've don't. you never read a good fictional book. And you read some like Harry Potter, or like some Legends of Dritz, or like, hell, Hunger Games. It doesn't matter, read some good stuff. Cause that's a good question, that's what that was. Yeah. When one million pounds every week, I'm pretty sure that's pounds, if not, do not, do not get mad at me. 1 million pounds every week, but 40% chance to get robbed every day. Uh, well, I mean, depends. Am I getting like, put your hands up, motherfucker? Am I getting that kind of robbed, or am I getting like, give me your wallet, or I'm gonna like stab you in a place where you won't die? I don't know. Because if they're just taking some of my money every day, that's fine. But if it's gonna be like a tragic experience every day, you know what, I'll just buy a really, really expensive security system and like buy security guards and stuff if I can win a million pounds every week. So yeah, I'll click that shit. I'll stab the robber. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you! There we go, 61%. I think we've been in the majority every time so far. You can talk to animals, but every animal on Earth treats you as a threat. I mean, it's kind of already like that. I mean, cats don't like me that much, other than my kitty. I don't know where she's at, though. It's kind of sad. She disappeared. She'll be back, though. She better be back. I'm gonna cry. Every animal on Earth treats you as a threat. I mean, like, I can just see it. It's like, you walk up to a dog, it's like, What's up, man? He's like, Fuck you! Fuck, fuck, feed me! But fuck you! Fuck you! Please feed me! Fuck you! I mean... No. Because animals talk a lot. They really do. If you've never had an animal that talks a lot, then I don't know. But my animals talk a lot. I, that's, a, yeah, nah, that's a bad question. 
sorry. You would get all of the Steam games for free. You can only play them offline. Well, shit. That, that's a good one. That, that is a very good one. Because of the fact that I like my solo player games, like single player games, but, you know, I like to get to play them with my friends. A lot. I think I could find a loophole in this and just make another account and buy the online games, but, you know, not. So, I won't do that. I'll just buy my games. I'll be good. It's okay. I got a job for a reason. It's not just buying stuff for YouTube. Okay. To start over as a new person, but you will have no memories of your past life. No. No, because that's the exact same as dying. You know, like... It's kind of, if you would have put your brain, everything, all of your memories into like a system and then they went to a robot or something, a lot of people don't think about it enough to realize that that would not be you. That would be a copy of you, but the person that you're living as now would not be there. I, that's, you have to be able to understand what I just said to know what it, like know what I mean. I guess that kind of doesn't make any sense, but it's no. No. If you ever have a chance to copy your memory and put it into something else, that's not going to be you. When it's time for you to die, it's time for you to die. Unless you can put your brain into something else, then it might work like that. Will you press the button? If you achieve world domination, everyone loves you, but you get herpes. <laughs> what? Okay. Um. I could be the leader of the whole world, and everyone loves me, but I have the herpes. Um, yes, because then I could put all the funding towards healing my herpes. Really? 47% press the button. You guys are... You gotta think about this stuff. That's a great question. Very simple, but great. <laughs> Will you press the button? You get to be a mighty hero, but the dark spawn and blood magic become real. Ooh! I've always... I kind of wished I was like in a fairy tale because that would be awesome to fight with swords and stuff like that but then you think about it in a realistic term and you know you'd probably die within 10 minutes so no I mean if I if I was like the mighty hero that never dies then hell yeah that was a good question it was your bank account immediately receives 50 million dollars but a random person you know will die instantly a random person I know will die instantly. No. I don't want to make anybody die just for me to be happy. I want other people to be happy. Like, if I could give that money to everybody else, and maybe nobody dies, then yeah, that wouldn't be that bad. But, no. Nobody dies because of me. You have five free pets of your choice, but you lose any pets you had before. No! No, that's not fair, because I have a dog and a cat, and I love them to death, but I really, really want a Savannah cat, which those are like the biggest domesticated cats in the world. I really want one, but they're like $15,000, and I could have five of them. That's five dog-sized cats, man. That's awesome, but I don't want to kill my cat or my dog. More the lines of my cat. I love my cat. Well, I love my dog too, but, you know, my cat though. You have mastery over all instruments and can play anything flawlessly from memory. You cannot speak. Hell no! I like talking. As you can tell, I like to yell. So, that's a good question for the quiet people. I know, I, I know a lot of quiet people that play instruments. They probably love that. You can control water. I don't want to be a waterbender. I don't care. I mean, it's that scary stuff. But every time you do it, a small animal in your possession dies. Wow. Okay, I can, can I just carry around like a satchel of mice? I'm gonna carry around a satchel of mice and just put them like, keep them alive in a big bag beside me, so then I can do water bending. Because if anybody attacks me, and I have like a bottle of water. I can like throw it up in the air. I can get all the water to come out of the bottle, and then go into their lungs, and then you know they can't fight me because they're dead. That's really dark. But that's good. <sighs> okay. That's a good question. Very good. 
You can help prevent the con 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 that. You can help prevent the con that suffering of billions of animals, but you can no longer consume any animal product. Yeah, yeah, I would do that. I I would go vegan so like no animals had to be sad anymore. I guess. But I mean, I don't want to make it where other people can't eat meat. If you like to eat cows and shit, eat cows and stuff. That's fine. And right now it's deer season, and I got a huge bag of deer jerky. And I'm happy with that. You know, but I don't want to see all those sad dogs in the commercials anymore. You will become homeless, but you will be truly happy for the rest of your life. I can't see that being a thing, because if I'm homeless, I'm out on the streets. And it's snowing right now. So that would fucking suck. I can't see me being happy through that. But... If there's a way for me to be happy through it, then yeah, true happiness is all anybody needs. So hell yeah. 61% press the button. You guys are epic people. High five! No, I'm not gonna hit my camera. That would that would probably suck. That's a good question. It was a good question. My my headphones are falling off. I don't need these anyways. It's no sound. So that's good. <laughs> you marry the perfect person, but you'll live forever in the other live forever and the other person not. Keep in mind you will be alone forever. Well, you know, I can marry the perfect person without this game, so no. Rather not. You know, it takes time to find the perfect person, but everybody finds their perfect person. And if you don't, then I'm sorry. That's a good question. It, it, it was good. It just depends on what kind of, like, what aspect you look at of it. You can cure cancer, but you'll be the last person in the world to die of cancer. Yes, that would that would save a lot of people, and that probably save a lot of suffering. And I feel like cancer's probably already cured, to tell you the truth. But businesses make so much money off of it, I highly doubt they'd ever actually release it. You have the opportunity to go into space and explore new worlds, but you can never ever come back to Earth, and you can't bring anyone you know with you. That's so hard. I don't know. I love space. I would do anything to be able to go to space. Because space is the best in the world. But. I have to leave my loved ones behind. And you know, I care a lot about them. And I want to, like, find that perfect girl one day. And marry her and all that stuff. But just imagine, I could go into space. And I could explore new worlds. And meet, like, meet new races. Like, that would be so awesome. Let's click that fucking button. There we go. 36% of the people press the button. What's wrong with you? What is wrong with you? A lot of stuff is wrong with you. That's what. I'm spitting all over everything. God damn it. Just leave them behind. You'll be immortal, but it will take a month for you to recover, and you would take 10 times the pain inflicted upon you. Mmm. No. It's time to die, it's time to die. I've already said that. That's the way it is. There's no reason to ever try to live further than what you already are. Any woman you desire will fall in love with you. Do, no, don't play with love. Every time a woman you desire is near you, their face will become an exact replica of your own. Well, I mean, who wouldn't want this? Yeah, no, nobody does. So, I don't even want this. So, no. 25% have pressed the button. That's, that's a good choice, guys. Do not press that shit. It's a good question, though. You make a critically praised movie, but it's a flop at the box office and you won't be a classic. I just want to make a movie, actually. I don't care if it's a classic. That's fine. 44% press the button. I don't think the 56% even understood that question because I don't even understand that question. I just want to make a freaking movie. Okay, win 1 billion on the lottery, but have to live in Sweden. Hell yeah. I'm going to hang out with PewDiePie's family. I'm sure they're pretty chill. Pretty sure he has a sister. I talk to her. Nah, I'm just kidding. No offense, PewDiePie. Hey, there's, there's a commercial for PewDiePie right here, too. <laughs> Good. Okay, well, let's go ahead and go to the next question. You get to make out with whoever you want, whatever you want, but in the midst of every makeout session, they vomit in your mouth a little. 
Okay, well, I'm not gonna answer that. You guys can answer that and just leave it down in the comment section below. And in the next video, I'll put the percentage up in the top left, right, up here. Yeah. Woo! So, I'll see you all next video. And I hope you all have a fantastic day. Boy!